I think I need another second to just realize like what just really happened. <sighs> wow. Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Now without wasting much time, let's just get back to the news. Uh, I mean, what really just happened? Like, like all of a sudden the F1 world has just erupted with the news, the two big news and that is Ricciardo moving to McLaren and Sainz moving to Ferrari. Yes, I mean, obviously we all knew that this this move was supposed to come. Maybe Ricciardo was supposed to go to Ferrari and then maybe Carlos wasn't supposed to leave McLaren. But then I, I don't know, just everything happened just so quickly. It, within a span of half an hour, there were two big announcements and both of them leading to this. And if you think of it, like I, I just saw the video that Science uploaded uh, just the moment after the, the announcement was made. And I think this move was a pre-planned move or maybe Ferrari knew that if Vettel wasn't going to uh, sort of sign the deal, then Science was already as a backup which was made ready. And then somewhere even he knew that, you know, he was going to join Ferrari and which is why a video was made. I don't know, maybe yes or maybe no, you won't. because it, the way you see the, the video that ha that he's uploaded is just cherishing the moment uh, at McLaren and also thanking everyone out there. That, that just can't be made within half an hour, right? Or it cannot be made or maybe it can be made in a day, but then that, that was like, wow. And honestly, I'm really going to miss science and Norris pair like the bromance which was going on. I mean, every one of us would be missing that for sure. But even more exciting is to see Ricciardo and Norris pair up. Like finally, that pair is happening and that is for real. Now, to be honest, 2020 season is anyways, we are already half year down the line and it's just half year left before we see the 2021 season and I am actually really excited to to see the 2021 season so uh, I, I don't know what is going to happen but it sure is going to be exciting now I don't know where this leaves Vettel like he may probably retire because there are no seats left apparently now with this uh, this scenario unfolding uh, I don't know maybe he becomes an ambassador for a, a team just like how Alonso was and also does that mean Alonso returns to Renault I mean that will be really interesting because we've been seeing Alonso teasing us with some posters so probably anyways let me know in the comment section below of all these latest developments where do you see Vettel going to do you think Alonso is returning back to Formula One and also what do you think of the pair of Sainz and Leclerc and also Ricciardo and Norris anyways I just wanted to make this announcement and wanted to know like what do you guys think about this so let me know in the comment section below and I shall see you in the next video bye bye and take care